Hello and welcome, guys. I'm Ferdinand Habsburg. Uh, maybe you might remember me without the mask from last year in DTM with Aston Martin. This year with WRT and Audi Sports. Looking forward to the season and looking forward to show you guys who my new teammates are. First on the line is Fabio Scherer. We'll introduce you to him and just follow me. So guys, this is my teammate Fabio, uh, joined us this year. Uh, one of the pleasure things is we like to meet each other nicely on track. One place I definitely don't want to meet him is on the ski course, because he used to be a professional skier and he'd definitely still be able to kick my ass. Maybe you can tell us a little bit about how you took the way things away from skiing and into your racing. Actually, it was quite difficult to decide me for racing. I was quite professional in skiing as well, but at the end it felt quite easy because in skiing you don't have the, the pedals on tracks. And now you definitely made the right choice because you're my teammate and you must be the favorite person you've ever worked with, right? Yes, for sure. <laughs> One more thing, Fabio, that we need to speak about. When I go to Switzerland, I love a cheese fondue, but I want to know what is your favorite cheese coming from Switzerland? Actually, I almost can tell it, but I don't like cheese. Well, isn't that a strange coincidence? And we continue. In here, we will find teammate number two, so why don't you just come and follow me in? So, Mr. Harrison Newey, some of you might have heard that name before, super famous dad. Did you get that love for motorsport through your father? I was lucky enough, my dad bought me a quad bike when I was four. And, and I was on that and I always spent pretty much my whole life on it when I was young. I, I'd come home from school, still in my school uniform, put my helmet on, go out. He was, he was at work still, I'd start it myself. And, uh, and that's when I realized that I really wanted to race cars, you know, or, or race something with an engine. One other thing I wanted to know is you lived in Japan racing uh, last year. And did you learn the language? Did you learn the culture? Um, I loved it. I thought it was really cool. You know, it's such a different place. I was so, so lucky as a 21 year old to live in a different country like that. I learned so much. The cars out there are incredible. The fans, the whole atmosphere out there is incredible. And I think the whole culture is so different to what we have in Europe. And I think everyone should go and experience it. As you can see, I'm a very lucky man having two very fun teammates this year. I'm looking forward to racing with these guys.